Okay, hello everybody. Oh, I've got the wrong. It's 501 up against Orcs here. Oh god, he's got a Pommer. He's got a 3 2 1 record. He's got a couple of Gobbles. So that's good. He's got, he's got a couple of Gobbles. There's a weakness to exploit there. But the Pom, a Strength 4 Frenzy. Oh my god. Dangerous team. Very dangerous team. Very dangerous team. <sighs> All right, if you had Dead Sora, sorry, fair enough. Goblins are not a weakness. Sorry, Moradam, sorry. I know it may offend yourself and uh, and Tibbum, but goblins are absolutely terrible. <laughs> um, <laughs> might offend PC as well. But yeah, sorry, goblins. Goblins are definitely the weak link in this team. That he has, All right? I don't even have a setup two. Okay, well, let's make a setup two. This is rough, isn't it? My team looks shit compared to his. <laughs> Fuck me. Yeah. He might just bang us out totally with a pawn. <laughs> yeah, exactly, Chunta, yeah. Yeah, PC may well. May well be falling out with me permanently. Insulting goblins. Doing the Dakar. Tactically defended. <laughs> Makes PC offended. <laughs> oh, it's so good. All we see is Jimmy doing the Dakar. Um, maybe for... No, no. No, I think AU is going to be Monday nights only after Claw. Problem is, the problem with the Among Us is, like, it would be best to do it on Friday and Saturday would be best for me to stay up late. Like, I'd like to get in some kind of routine where I actually wake up in the mornings, to be honest. But also, like, I've got no time for bullshit. <laughs> and Among Us is just bullshit, isn't it, really? So. So that's the problem. There's so many things I've got to do that I might, I'm going to try and cut down on the bullshit. I mean, it is fun bullshit. Don't get me wrong, it's a lot of fun. And you can't just, you can't be 100% serious all the time and stuff. <laughs> exactly, Chuck. Yeah, like, streaming is bullshit, right? So I'm already spending, I'm already, like, spending X amount of my day doing bullshit anyway, right? So the time when I'm not streaming, I should be doing something that isn't bullshit. I feel like I should have a wizard against this chap. This is very sad. to do more than just like it's still just doing bullshit right I can do YouTube uploads on the side but I do something else I do something else more constructive than dicking around playing Among Us I mean I do love playing Among Us to be fair like it's the most fun it's so much fun well, this is an amazing first turn <laughs> I 
<laughs> no, no, Volk. I started talking bollocks with Art at 5am. I talked bollocks with him till 7am. <laughs> <laughs> I'd literally tried to go to sleep at 5. I'd, I went to bed at 5. What happened, Volk? I went to bed at 5, right? And I turned off my computer. But... You know when it says update and shut down or update and restart, I misclicked update and restart. So like, so I got into bed and that, and then <laughs> still, and I thought I'll just turn up, I'll get up and turn off my computer, right? So then I went up and then and then I was like, oh, I'll just have a look at Discord, and then ended up uh, ended up getting back up. <laughs> for the gobble or don't I? Oh, <laughs> dwarving. <laughs> Look at his eyes. <laughs> Jimmy's only 26. <laughs> I look worse. I look worse with the lighting. The lighting, the lighting plays tricks. I'm not anywhere near as pale as it looks. Believe it or not. Believe it or not. Look at his eyes. Listen to his sleep patterns. Yeah, my sleep patterns are, are pretty fucked. I'll be honest. But, uh... No, I mean, I do love Blood Bowl, of course, and that's cool. I need to, uh, I need to, uh, I need to look at the intro game. Because that intro game, it, like, it was pretty good, I thought, but it's, it's, like, it's really old. And it was when Blood Bowl 2016 came out, wasn't it? Um, that's why I did it. I did it, I did it when Blood Bowl 2016 came out on tabletop, which was good. But, like, now they're not the base teams anymore, right? So it's a bit not irrelevant but it's not as relevant as it was and uh also fash is in it and i could probably do with fash not being in the video just because he's a dickhead you know no offense to fash well hey well there's there's the goblin taken care of amazing So we could push him out, but it's not really doing a lot, is it? You go in there. Maybe. He can punch to save himself. Hey, glorious. <laughs> Get fucked, stupid troll. Not my twat magnet. Let's 
Cool then. Do I need a new racist Australian? <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> Oh dear. Yeah, I thought Nick was American. Hey, he caught it, yeah, he caught it. Shouldn't I? He just literally caught the kickoff. <laughs> Which has worked out alright for him in terms of sacking it, but uh, not alright for him in terms of running forward, is it? Maybe this guy should have been there. Because, yeah, he can bolt down. This strength fought frenzy here is a bit annoying, isn't it? Let's just bang everyone down then. Guard could go in, but then he might just get powered. Maybe a 2D him. Oh, I can no. I can 2D first? No, I can't. 2D and them both would be really good, wouldn't it? Because then it isolates the troll as well. But giving up a hit on the blodger. It's a bit shit. Hello, Skuron. And there's a very good chance of impounding the blodger, unfortunately. I'm just greedy for all these hits, though. Calcium. Oh, thank God I did that. God. I could try the three two out, couldn't I? Three two two, get all the way down there. Let's go here. I'd like something in the way. Could go there actually. Maybe I should have dodged to here for his dead body to be there. There, yeah, that would have been good, wouldn't it? Not really, he can just go dagging around. But that was something I should have thought of anyway. Oh, he can just move a guy in there anyway, fuck's sake. I thought this is great because I've screened off the troll, but I hadn't screened off the troll. However, we have outnumbered him three versus four there, and this one is easily movable. So. Oh, he gets the power. Oh, he's got tackle. Okay, good. Well, that means at least he didn't blitz with. Okay. At least he didn't. 
split with Pom. Mankis. I don't even know how good Mankis' team is, to be honest, I can't remember. Probably not as good as my Wood Elves, but you wouldn't feel sorry for anyone facing my Wood Elves, would you? I guess his team's very rowdy. Very rowdy. Yep, of course he's powered. It was never going to not be a power that hit, was it? Armour break as well? Yep. Cast? No, not a cast. Two fucking stuns there is brutal. <laughs> Fucking game, honestly. <sighs> Visualizing and actualizing. Thanks, school. Bloody chunter and chunter and calcium colluding disgraceful. <laughs> That's just a joke, by the way, in case in case anyone's stupid. <laughs> oh done, because he caught he caught the kick up. Caught the kick off for that guy. Whoa. Annoying that I got like an advantage and then had to give it up to just try and move around. This is okay though, isn't it? Oh shit, I could have blitzed. Nah, not really. Right, 2D him. Two D him, then two D him. I want I want to two D this this lad. Definitely want him to deed. <laughs> Does he dodge to there? And then punch him. Yeah, I think so.
Once again, thanks for the video. It really helped me sort Blood Bowl into the bare basics. Oh, thanks very much, Dwarvey. Very nice of you. That's good news. It's cool that, like, these old videos still get views and that, innit? Because that was, like, that was made... Ah, oh, fuck. A long time ago. So it's cool that it's, uh... You know, people are still getting something from it. It's very cool. Thank you very much. <laughs> Tooled up chuffs. I know, yeah, simply a sensei. Well, I'm enjoying it again now. So there you go. Yes, that's true, Skrull, yeah. But it's still, it's still kind of just wild, isn't it? Because, you know, like... It's just wild on a, like, a personal kind of level, you know, that it was made so long ago. Do you know what I mean? Like, I do realise that a lot of, you know, stuff is going to be out of date with other games and, like, Blood Bowl doesn't really go out of date. But it's just kind of mad that it was, like, that video was literally made, like, you know, over five years ago. Just doing a one day. <laughs> oh, fuck off, hamheads. <laughs> Fuck off, Hammers. <laughs> I said I was going to play them a lot, which I never did. If I had played them, I a also lot, want to thank you for the done. video. I never knew that was how you'd prefer to fuck a goblin. Wait, which video were we talking about again? <laughs> Thanks, thanks, Moradam. I mean, to me, the goblin fucking is obvious, right? Like, it's not even a choice between a goblin and an orc, is it? We might, we might have a two D on the ball here, guys. <laughs> you won't shoot. A, can you shoot a play, guys? <laughs> can you, can you shoot a play here? <laughs> you won't shoot us anywhere else, guys. <laughs> oh, maybe I could like do a chain to make it. Better? Yeah. Yeah, alright, this actually is decent, isn't it? Oh, he's got guard. Fuck. Oh, this is still fine. I can just push him to there and then blitz in that way, right? What I wanted to do was I wanted to chain with this to get him to there and then him, but this actually works out better. As long as I get a pal. Hey. Yes. Because then there was even two guards on for the, another hit, wasn't there? Oh, imagine if he just caught that. What a bad ass. Hmm. That's a bit disappointing. So he picks it up, hands it off. He runs. Oh, he's got dodge. And then he can hand it off. And then he could run up to there. And then punch. Then I've got the dodge, haven't I, if I use the rear roll and the pickup. Nah, I think I want it on the dodge. Yeah. Nah, but this is slightly safer doing it this way.
Oh. Oh. Perfectly timed. Perfectly timed. Whew. <laughs> wow, Hamid. Don't be mean, please. I think the ability isn't that good, Dwarving. I think it's weird that it's... Like, I think it's weird, and I think it's weird. It's a weird rule, and it's weird that it's happened, and I think... Oh, fuck. And it sets like... That's disappointing, isn't it? Again, Okay, good. Oh, no one killed. Yeah, I think it's just like weird. I think it's just kind of like weird. That's the thing that I think about. That it's weird that it happened. But like, I think I don't know. It's good. It's uh, the little halfling riding a brain. Yeah. Um. So yeah, I don't know. I don't know about that. Lovely play, guys. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's the thing. Is it's not as if like it's not as if uh, it's not as if it's just not possible to make the plays. It's just uh, risking that, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, it takes a long time to get them though because they only get second. Place. I could have gone on the sideline. Whoops. Whoopsie. I could have gone on the sideline. <laughs> no, maybe I couldn't. One, two, three, four, five, six, six, seven, eight. Yeah, I could have gone on the sideline. Shit. I just did that by default. Lazy. Lazy and shit player. Probably not punished. Yeah, exactly, Volk. Yeah, yeah, yeah that, that like drip fed complexity. Is with, yeah, it's a bit weird. Yeah, yeah. yeah it's a player. Yeah, it doesn't have swarming, so like it's a bit shit having a 20 TV player. Yeah, at the end of your opponent's turn, so you've got to position it. Like, so basically, you'd do Norse, you'd probably set up Norse in like a space defenders, like, uh, space defenders. What's, what's that called? What's that called? Not space defenders. Uh, what's that fucking space invader? You'd send up in a space invader formation with a beer pig like there, and then everybody who knocked down would come up on a 5 plus. Um, but like, it's a bit shit. It's just a bit shit, really. It's not going to be that, going to be that good. Because like, to get one player stood up, it's got to affect three, hasn't it? And it's a twenty k player, so it's like, it's just, it's a bit shit. But it, it's good as like a twelfth man, isn't it? it a twelfth man for twenty k is all right, isn't it? Or a, or a thirteenth man for twenty k. You know, just a little bit of insurance. Oh yeah, you can you can use them to get bigger stars if formats allow. He's found the black orc. Is it a double four? No, never lucky. You literally just found the black orc guys. What the hell? Flip me. I could hit 
him. I think it's better to hit him, isn't it? Even though he's uh, even though he's tougher. It's just so much bigger payoff if he's removed. Uh, uh, I'm not gonna score there, I'm gonna score here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, only all, it's yeah, it's okay, isn't it? Twenty K Fowler is okay. I would have it as like the twelfth or thirteenth player that you don't need, basically. And then it's just like a little bit of insurance, isn't it? Oh shit. Well that they were not the KO rolls I was looking for. The double ones. Nine players. He's only got ten though, hasn't he? No, he's still got eleven. Shit. Shit. Well, he's kind of got ten. He's got ten and a half. He's got a goblin. <laughs> Good joke. Good joke, Volk. You're a funny guy. You're a funny guy, Volk. That's why I'll kill you last. This is fine. My elves are MA9. <laughs> yeah, I forgot. I fucking love that film. I love every Arnie film, to be fair. Well, not everyone. I haven't seen like some of his later ones. Because I just thought they'd be shit, so I didn't even watch them. Stupid fucking game. <laughs> An idiot didn't roll a two plus. As many pigs as, as you can have, as you are. Buy the Forge World booster pig for twenty, yeah. That'd be pretty that'd be pretty games workshop. Booster pig. <laughs> Fuck off, Hulk. <Bob. laughs> Daggering's so good. Well, it's so fun, isn't it? And it's... Like, the thing is... The thing is with... Uh, everyone makes the argument of, you know, like, they look at a drive where a Dakar doesn't work. And then they go, ah, the Dakar's shit, it didn't work in this particular case. And you can just do the same for a normal drive, can't you? So like, they just like people who criticise the DACA act like every other drive is an automatic success, and every other drive is not an automatic success. <laughs> Which is uh. <laughs> No. No. 
I mean, that looks pretty stupid, right? <laughs> that looks pretty stupid. Yes, indeed, Hancock, yeah. The cat is having catch, does me. The Dakar, uh... <laughs> <laughs> I mean, this looks pretty shit right now. Yes, yeah, it does. It do, like you know the the vanity passing does make it a bit better, obviously. Nah, maybe I shouldn't have vanity passed. Like with only nine players and it potentially giving up a pom hit. I think it was pretty unlucky at double one wasn't it? Nice. Wow, agreed to hit a fucking lino. Outrageous. Outrageous. Nothing makes the DACA better. You can't improve on perfection. <laughs> this is a bit risky, isn't it? Oh, fuck off. Yeah, that's true still, that's true. That's true. Oh shit, yeah, no Norse could uh Norse could take Norse could take pile driver. Pile drive and then stand up at the end of their opponent's turn. <laughs> What's this here? Oh, it's the fucking crow on the pitch. I was like, what's this on, on the in my background? But it's the it's a little look, it's a little crow there. <laughs> what a fucking idiotic thing. You'd think so, wouldn't you try? Yeah, that, that sounds like that sounds like a, a, a purple chest criticism of the Dakar. Not a Crystal Hunter one. I don't see why it wouldn't. It depends if it's a skill or like extraordinary or whatever. Or whatever the fuck the rules are for them always like always having an effect. I can't remember. Pile driver beer pig though is brilliant, isn't it? This is a bit stupid, wasn't it, this place? Oh my god!
Does he go for the fight plus dodging with a friends? Yeah. Yeah, pigs with sneaky girl. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, yeah, a 20k player, like a 20k player is a pretty good shout on any team, isn't it? Just because it's 20k, so having a 20k player, <laughs> like, is decent, isn't it? It's give, it gives you, like, super cheap bench. I'd take, a, I'd take, like, a Snotling on pretty much every team. Glorious team. It's a big, big mug, big swing. Yeah, I would take a Snotling on High Elves, absolutely. Absolutely, I would take a Snotling on High Elves. Why not? Like, it's better than nothing, isn't it? And at the end of the first half, if you're not down and you've got, like, you've got one turn, then he comes on and fouls, doesn't he? <laughs> This, this drive's gone a bit shit, hasn't it? To be fair, there's been two chances to break through and both times I've rolled shit. And whether this was a uh, Dakar or not, rolling shit on crucial turns would suck. Oh, this is really tempting, isn't it? Okay, this is this is pretty tempting, guys. Let's go for this here. Okay, it went wrong. It went wrong. <laughs> <laughs> because of fucking course it did. Because nothing can go right for this team. God damn it. Just a push and then there's the two plus out for the reroll. Like you're not using the reroll, I needed this guy first, didn't I? That was the thing. So it's just literally anything. It was a three plus. But just not or not or not using the reroll. And then he could have come up and blitzed through. This frenzy all the way over here. Can't even hit. Good. Glorious. No, I won't give in. Until I'm victorious. And I will defend. I will defend. Thanks very much. I'm gonna just dodge here. See, there is there was the one. <laughs> Instant one trying to dodge the guard. That was always going to happen once the reroll was gone. Flip me, guys. This team hasn't been unlucky, has it? Actually, when I was saying this team, I was thinking of the chaos this season, really, rather than this team. This team's been pretty all right. Uh, Iron Sirius, thank you very much. Welcome to Team Fantastic. Oh yeah. Absolutely glorious. Just jump over. Yeah. Yeah, that's a good point, Try. That's a good point. Ah! 
glorious bedroom. Yeah, I think uh, I think the DACA is alive and well, certainly. Proels can Proels can do passes on their on their blitzers. Can pass with their blitzers, but you mostly just lose the you just lose the vanity part mostly, don't you? That's the that's the thing. You kind of you kind of lose the vanity part. What I'd like to do is blitz here, wouldn't I? I guess I can. Who couldn't do this if it wasn't a Daka? Just quietly. I might have already lost if this wasn't a Daka. Like literally, like you know, it's easy to say, "Oh, you wouldn't be this far deep again," but at the end of the day, if this wasn't a Daka, maybe they'd already taken the ball when when I'd rolled bad on those turns, right? Maybe they'd already given up the ball then. <laughs> this looks a bit shit, doesn't it? I don't think I want to put in a re-roll either. Oh, yeah, baby. <laughs> All right, not terrible. <laughs> yeah, exactly, Try Like, it might have been, yeah. It feels that way, right? Like, that's the, this is the thing. It's easy to, like, point to, like, you know, that one day working and saying... Or, you know, like, it's easy to be super biased one way or the other. Like, that's the thing. I think people who are... People who are anti daca are too anti daca That's That's all. That's all, I think. I just think, I just think it's, uh, I just think it's, uh, this was shit, wasn't it? Because obviously I really wanted to make an extra GFI with him, but I just, I didn't want to not, I didn't want to lose, well, draw one in 36 times. Yeah, exactly, try, exactly, right? That's the thing, it's like... It, this is the problem. Yeah. Yeah, there's been so many shit blitzers that have done nothing. Oh god, this is the guarder as well. Still got the apple though. Like, it's incredibly easy for to just say, you know, oh, the DACA, look. Like, it's easy to be too pro DACA and too pro and too anti dacker I think. I think it's too easy to be too extreme either. Oh wow, it's a, it's a good foul. 
I have done it myself. There we go. Please work, Apple. Don't even need it. Oh yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, some people could. You know, not me, of course. I'm, I'm perfect and would never be over the top. But people could be over the top. It's not like it's not like that. I think it's the best, unequivocally the best. I think it's the most fun, and I like it the most. But I wouldn't be. I just think it's too easy to criticize. That's the thing. I think it's too easy to criticize. Just to say you know, oh look, you know, it would be like this. Yeah. <laughs> not necessarily, Chunky. Not necessarily. Not necessarily at all. Because your fail state is then your whole team getting based by orcs. But, you know, and then and then now you've got more crucial. It's just, it's just it, the point is, it's just stupid. And there's so many like stupid comments that are like, oh, now you know you rolled a double one there, so the deck is shit. And I just think that's shit and wrong. <laughs> She is happy chuckles. Oh, okay, Calcium. Maybe maybe I'm not pro Dakar anymore. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, to be fair, Boris Johnson would love the Dakar because he'd just take the opportunity to pay his to pay his players half wages because they only play half the game. <laughs> yeah, exactly, Hammers, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you roll dice with a ball by quick scoring. Exactly, you can't not roll. Like, you can't score in two turns without a handoff for a pass or something. So, like, all these people who are, like, just two turn, well, it, it, you, like, the chance of you being able to pick up and score with the same... Like, you could, obviously, with a move nine catcher, there's, there's a chance of you just, you know, getting a decent kick and, and not having to transfer the ball. But there's a chance of you having to transfer the ball as well. A high chance of you having to transfer the ball, which, which becomes, you know, pretty critical, pretty... Uh, Pretty, uh, no, I wouldn't do that. Screw dude. Do that. Yeah, Chunter, but if if people position well enough against normal strategies, it's hard, right? <laughs> right? <laughs> oh. Fuck's sake! Man. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, exactly, Try. Yeah, like, it's true, right? It's true. It's true of everything. That was my point. That was my point, you know, against Cruz in, in the playoffs, which people enjoyed that comment. Like, try playing a proper drive against Crucifer. It's not easy. It's not easy. It's not easy to stall for eight turns against Cruz. You know. Oh, it's broken neck. Yeah. Yeah, everything is shit hit when opponents play better. That is it. Right, it's as simple as that, I don't know. I like I just That's what I don't like about all of the DACA criticisms, because they're all they're all based on the situation, aren't they? As if as if the the counter to the DACA is an automatic two turn. Believe me, if I could just automatically score in two turns without any dice rolls and any chance of failures <laughs> and a hundred percent take a two turn score, you just you just move the turn counter two spaces and you're two nil up. Yes, I would do that. <laughs> but after trying to quick score many, many times in my life, it's not like that, is it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly, Hancock. And that's the only thing that matters, isn't it, really?
Yeah, maybe Odon, maybe. That, that's valid. That's valid. But you've also like got the stall, right? If unless you can score in two. And it protects your team. The protecting your team helps a lot. Even though I got hit quite a lot. Made loads of dodges. Like it it gives you the it, it protects your team against getting banged out, which is good. Something something Chunter obviously doesn't value fireboarding his own players when he's winning 3-0. But <laughs> <laughs> Protecting your team, I, I value quite a bit. <laughs> Alright, 12 players. Got a touchdown on him, that's good. He needs dodge, obviously. He's well on his way to block. These will eventually get SPPs randomly, I guess. Maybe he should try to get 26. Maybe he should try and get a couple of completions to go to 26 in case of an MVP. And these are on 11 already, so they don't need one. He obviously needs one. He can get one, maybe, to have a chance. So pretty, looking pretty good. Six wins and a loss. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.